The Tourism and Antiquities Ministry of Egypt recently disclosed a remarkable archaeological discovery of a small sphinx statue from the Roman era. The artifact, crafted from limestone, was uncovered during an excavation of the Denra Temple located beside the Nile River in Akina Province. Archaeological experts have speculated that the Sphinx may depict Claudius, the Roman emperor who reigned between 41 and 54 CE. Although the Roman Empire ruled ancient Egypt for over 600 years, many Roman emperors, including Claudius, never visited. In ancient Egypt, Sphinxes were symbolic of royalty and power, and the newly discovered statue features royal features and a slight smile with two dimples. According to excavation leader Mando al damadi an archaeologist at Ain Shams University and the former Minister of Antiquities, in a translated statement. Additionally, the Sphinx's face has remnants of red and yellow coloring and it is wearing a traditional striped cloth headdress known as a nemes, which was commonly worn by ancient Egyptian pharaohs. The tip of the headdress resembles a cobra, which is a feature called a ureus. The researchers first found a limestone shrine with two levels and steep sloping floors at the excavation site. Inside the shrine, they discovered a water storage basin made from red brick. The Sphinx was found while they were carefully cleaning the basin and below it was a stone slab covered in hieroglyphics and script. Although no translations have been made, the researchers compared the Sphinx's face to depictions of Roman emperors and concluded that Claudius was the best match. However, they also stated that more research is necessary and other experts not involved in the project expressed their doubts. Eric Varner, an art historian at Emory University, said, The photos are a little small for me to confirm if it is Claudius or not, but I can see a Claudian aspect to the image, according to Live Science. The basin dates back to the Byzantine era, approximately 500 years after Claudius' reign. If the newly discovered Sphinx does indeed depict Claudius, it would not be surprising to archaeologists. In the past, a sphinx-like sandstone bust resembling the Roman Emperor Vespasian, who ruled from 69 to 79 CE, was found. Archaeologists also uncovered a carving showing Claudius as an Egyptian pharaoh at the Temple of Isis. Researchers began their exploration in mid-February using magnetic and radar scans, and they plan to continue their work at the Temple of Horus and the Isis Gate to discover a road that links the two sites. Mahmoud El Mitani, president of Ain Shams University, says that the ongoing excavations will add a lot to the history of Egyptian civilization in the Greek and Roman ages, per a statement from the university. The Sphinx of Giza is a magnificent statue that has captured the imaginations of people worldwide for centuries. This colossal monument is a symbol of ancient Egypt's grandeur, mystery, and enigma. The Sphinx of Giza has stood the test of time and weathered the harsh elements of the desert and remains one of the world's most iconic and recognizable landmarks. The Sphinx is believed to have been built during the reign of Pharaoh Khafre in the 26th century BCE. It is made of limestone and stands approximately 6 to 6 feet tall and 240 feet long. The statue is in the shape of a mythical creature with the body of a lion and the head of a human, often thought to represent the Pharaoh's divine status. The Sphinx is situated on the west bank of the Nile River, facing the sunrise. It was originally meant to guard the entrance to Khafre's mortuary temple and it still stands as a powerful sentinel to this day. The statue's eyes are believed to be aligned with the rising sun on the summer solstice, marking the beginning of the new year in ancient Egyptian culture. Over the years, the Sphinx has undergone numerous renovations and restorations. The statue was covered with sand for many years, and in the 18th century, it was finally uncovered and restored by Napoleon's troops. Despite its many restorations, the Sphinx still shows signs of damage caused by erosion, pollution, and even vandalism. The Sphinx of Giza has been a subject of fascination and intrigue for centuries and many discoveries have been made about this ancient wonder over the years. Through archaeological excavations and research, experts have uncovered new information about the Sphinx shedding light on its history, construction, and symbolism. One of the most significant discoveries about the Sphinx came in 2010 when a team of archaeologists found a set of tunnels and chambers beneath the statue. The tunnels run from the Sphinx's paw to the mortuary temple of Khafer, and the chambers contain artifacts and inscriptions that suggest the Sphinx was part of a larger complex. Another important discovery was made in 2014, when researchers found evidence of repair work done on the Sphinx during the reign of Pharaoh Tutankhamun. The researchers found marks on the statue's shoulders and back that suggest that it was restored using blocks of stone from nearby quarries. In recent years, scientists have also used new technologies like ground-penetrating radar and laser scanning to uncover new information about the Sphinx. In 2018, researchers used ground-penetrating radar to map the Sphinx's interior, revealing the presence of additional tunnels and cavities. One of the most fascinating discoveries about the Sphinx is its potential astronomical significance. 
Some researchers believe that the Sphinx may have been built to align with certain celestial events, such as the rising sun on the spring and autumn equinoxes. This theory is based on the Sphinx's orientation, which is slightly off-center from due east. The Sphinx's symbolism has also been a subject of research and debate. While the statue is widely believed to represent the pharaoh Khafre, some experts believe that it may have been meant to embody the sun god Ra or the lion goddess Sekhmet. The Sphinx's enigmatic smile has also been the subject of speculation, with some experts suggesting that it may have been intended to convey a sense of benevolent power or even humor. Despite the many discoveries that have been made about the Sphinx, many questions remain unanswered. The monument's purpose, construction techniques, and symbolism continue to fascinate and inspire people worldwide, ensuring that the Sphinx of Giza will remain a subject of fascination and wonder for generations to come. Here are some facts about the Sphinx that you need to know. The Sphinx is believed to have been built during the reign of the pharaoh Khafre who ruled Egypt in the 4th dynasty around 2500 BCE. The statue was carved from a single block of limestone and stands over 6 to 6 feet, 20 meters tall and is 240 feet, 73 meters long, making it one of the largest statues in the world. One of the most notable features of the Sphinx is its enigmatic smile. The smile has been the subject of much speculation over the years with some people believing that it represents the pharaoh's benevolent nature while others believe that it symbolizes the Sphinx's role as a protector of the afterlife. The Sphinx was built as a guardian for the nearby pyramids, and it was intended to protect the pharaoh's burial chamber from evil spirits and other dangers. It was also believed to be a symbol of the pharaoh's power and divine authority. Despite its imposing size and iconic status, the Sphinx has undergone several periods of damage and restoration over the centuries. In the 18th century, the Sphinx was partially buried in sand, and it was only rediscovered in the early 19th century. Since then, it has undergone several rounds of restoration work to preserve its structure and prevent further deterioration. There are many mysteries surrounding the Sphinx, including its construction and purpose. Some scholars believe that the Sphinx was originally painted with bright colors, while others believe that it may have had a beard or other decorative elements that have been lost to time. The Sphinx has also been the subject of many legends and myths over the years. One of the most famous is the story of Oedipus, who answered the Sphinx's riddle and was rewarded with the throne of Thebes. Despite the many mysteries and legends that surround the Sphinx, it remains an enduring symbol of ancient Egypt and one of the most beloved and recognizable monuments in the world. Whether viewed from afar or up close, the Sphinx is a testament to the power and creativity of the ancient Egyptian civilization that created it. What do you think of this video and the mysteries behind the Sphinx? Please let us know in the comments below. And most importantly, if you wish to be updated about more history viral videos, you should consider to subscribing to our channel and pressing the bell icon so we can make more videos for you. For seeing more videos about ancient Egypt, please watch our playlist for more interesting videos about Egypt. Also, thank you for watching the videos and we will see you in the next video.